Dumas and Absolution. Dumas and Absolution on setup one. On setup two, can we have Junior Dumas and Dookie? Dumas and Dookie. Setup two. On stream, can we have Six Echo and Mozo? Six Echo and Mozo on stream. Light and Bash, you have Blights. Blue Menace, Hardy, and Ready Blue, you're ready for me. And you're the running is a little late, but I'm gonna be Thank you, man. Good luck. All right, people. We have got some Street Fighter 6 right now for you. We got Mozo and Six Echo, two people who aren't usually here at Hog. Uh, glad they could come today. That's pretty sick. I think this is Mozo's first time competing a Street Fighter here. Um, I think the sides are reversed. Like they picked the wrong side. Um, yeah, because Six Echo plays Guile. Get this mission started. All right. Oh, hey, Will! <laughs> Got the bad mic. Tesla! Tesla! Yeah, this look great. Yeah, you just need to make sure that you talk into the part that's like... Like this? Oh yeah, that's perfect. That's awesome. Might have to hold it a little bit. Yeah. It's annoying, but get you know, used to it. All right, these two were actually, I think, playing some friendly before this. Um, so, sometimes that happens. Some friendly, some casuals, I mean. Sorry. <laughs> Smasher alert. Uh, so so alert. Sound the alarm. <laughs> Alright, uh... Looks pretty decent from uh, what I've seen. Yeah, decent pressure. Not a lot of throwing going on. Maybe that'll change soon. Nice little three-piece nice. combo. Ooh, great anti-air. That's probably the most damage that got can get meterless. But he did have a lot of meters, so I'm surprised he didn't try to cash out there. Be a little conservative with bar. That's gonna be it. That's hard. Yep, do the easy heavy heavy drag rush heavy combo. Tax yeah. guile. Really, you know, if you have a kill and you don't have to spend any super, better make it to, better to make it as easy as possible, you know. Ooh, I think he missed, he missed up his hard over right there. Yeah, a bit of a drop. Punch to back heavy punch. Um, and then you can do level 1 or level 3 from there. Probably would have done level 3. Cash out, get some drive gauge advantage. Ooh, good jump. Nice. Okay, level, level 1. one. Crouching medium. Oh, he's, he takes space instead. So Guile has a, a safe jump off the aerial level 1. You can do... Crush the medium kick, and then that uh, frame kill is just enough to do uh, a forward jump that will safe jump. Very Maybe reserved on the that. flash kicks. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, with this kind of a lead, think about how many times Luke has to, like, get these, like, straight hits. And even on, like, a really clean hit, you still have to win, like, another exchange after that, even if you cash out with level 3. But if you're Mozo, cashing out with level 3 is kind of scary because Guile almost has level 3 himself. And if you cash out, you're going to go to the next round three bars down, right? Um, yeah, but I mean, probably better than losing the, the game, right? But, Very safe guile play. Yeah. Alright. That's one of those classic, like, I was holding down back, and then, like, I pressed heavy, standing heavy punch, but, like, I do it from the release down fast enough, so you do the correct heavy punch. Which is, um... On hit, not punishable or anything. 
You certainly can't combo off of it on, on normal hit. Uh, but on block is simply punishable. Jumps back, avoids the sandblast. Ooh, goes for the jumping bike kick cross up. Very patient play, like, no real reason to like really risk anything with a life lead like this. Because Luke has to come to you at this point. I don't think I've heard the soundtrack on this. Is this like a custom change? They did some music things recently. Oh, that's that's pop. Oh, I know as DLC that. they added uh, a bunch of the older Street Fighter songs. Yeah. So right there, um, Mozo was at like one health and then like in burnout. So if you're Guile there, you can just like throw an EX Sonic Boom and they just get hit on makeup. They can't do anything about it. Um, even if they do level two to get through it, uh, you will be able to recover fast enough on that as long as you do it meaty. But he ended up doing Drive Rush, maybe he wasn't charging and didn't have charge ready. Ooh, good whip punish. If you want it to burn out, you definitely need that level 3 to recover like, a good amount of it. Plus you got corner here, your offense doesn't change a whole lot if you're in burnout. It used to not change at all, but now recently with the uh, drive reversal changes where you can wake up drive reversal. Uh, drive reversal on a burned out opponent on their block is actually not punishable. Uh, okay. So I think it's like minus four, but like it puts you outside of like jack range. But I could be wrong. I forget I forget exactly what it was. I remember it being like a small difference and that made it so that it's safe against the burnout. Oh, I actually got the conversion! Woo! Flash kick! I don't know. If you're not gonna press a button, uh, you may as well be charging. Uh oh, burned out here. This is really oh, scary. Oh, no, Luke needs to EX. Oh, EX. No, 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 it's... Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, if, if I was Mozo there, I mean, I would be doing uh, the EX uh, sandblast there. It goes through the projectile, but uh, Guile was in burnout, it might have either been chipped, but he had enough bar to maybe do that even twice, you know, what's, what's Guile to do? He has to read exactly the timing of your of your sandblast, and if he's wrong even a little bit and gets into your still you know. Really, really good risk of work. And depending on the situation, maybe even unreactable for Guile. Or, like, impossible to evade, really. Nice, nice conversion here. That's actually kind of hard. Doing the the target combo and the flash kick there, um, it's a tight timing. You really need to get comfortable changing your charge oh, there we go. right away. Yeah, that was one of the first flash kicks we've seen in the whole set. Yeah, very reserved. <laughs> very uh, particular about their anti-airs. Yeah. Oh, no punish though. Yeah, he ended up tapping uh, Barry, and they actually nerfed. It's gonna be that. They nerfed uh, tapping parry to be like five frames longer or something. So Oh looking for looking for the shimmy there. Maybe looking for a throw. Mm -hmm. Still though, uh I, I I don't know how you pronounce that guy's name. Six Echo? Oh six yeah, six echo is uh playing this really patient. Going for the heavy boom, uh, heavy uh, sonic uh, blades. It's kind of hard to get away with a, a heavy sonic blade because it's so slow. Unless you have like Oki or, or some kind of thing that otherwise where they're in pressure. Okay. Mozo likes cashing out into burnout himself. It's not that bad here because you kind of you have guile on the ropes here. Yeah. <clears throat> so here's the, here's the cool thing about when it be when it's a best of five or a first to three instead of a first to two. When you thought it was a first to two and you thought you lost, you already accepted defeat, right? You already accepted defeat. But then like when you have a, when you're given another chance, now you're hungry. You're like, ooh, I'm just chilling now. I already thought I lost. Can't get worse than that. So I want to see it go to two to game four here. See how that changes like the dynamic in the set, you know? Yeah, Mozo is looking a little more comfortable right now. Great yeah. anti here. Okay. Oh, actually, let go of Perry. This is gonna be a 
nice. Uh, not the best punish, but damage nonetheless. Yeah. Nice. Nice. One strike throw away. Oh, that could have been a deep. Oh, oh, very nice. Good confirm. Good for him into the, the four frame, into like seeing that it punish countered and then doing the medium punch, you know? Ooh, get the punch counter, bro. That's a big chunk. Very nice. Didn't get the wall splat, but this is great damage nonetheless. Yeah. You get, you get damage scaling if it wall splats there, so. Maybe it's even for the best. Kill? Oh, yeah, wow. Yep, getting in his zone. Getting in his zone, his mo zone. You like that one, Will? <laughs> <laughs> Mag magnificent fun, Artie. <laughs> Excellent. His mo zone. Glory to hug. Send him into the mo zone layer. Spend a little on that too. <laughs> extra damage. Okay. Even did it. Looks like he did a little bit, little bit of delay there too. In that combo. Okay. Drive reversal. Oh, jumps the overhead, he even gets the cross up. Man, bringing it almost to reverse 30, hold up. Yeah, that was a the really, really dominant <laughs> round. Yeah. Just really turned it Bozo up. getting in his comfort zone. Just kind of rushing Guile down here. Maybe Echo needs to start holding, uh, like, prepping Flash Kick more often, because it feels like uh, Mozo is able to get a lot of these good ones. Spending a lot of meter trying to use the zoning. Oh, look, if only he had flash kick, you know? If, if you're Guile here, you need to press the advantage. You need to make sure that this drive game doesn't regenerate. Oh, big jump in. It, it didn't even punish counter, so there was a flash kick ready there, you know? Yeah. Also, medium, medium moves doing more drive gauge damage. Um, that could that could be a way for him to press this advantage here. Ooh. Oh, the handshake! So many, so many flash kicks potentially. Is uh, no, it doesn't super one. cancel. Oh, but the oh, shimmy. That's incredibly hard. And gets to keep the meter hard. for the next round. M five here. Resources oh, are a little even. He gets the opening. I feel like if you hit the drive rush cross you medium punch, that's plus enough that like you can just press another button, right? Yeah. Like, even on block. From what I understand, yes. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, actually, man. really ballsy jump. The anti airs for these guys, they're, they're too, they're too like worried about the ground movement to be looking for the anti air, and they keep catching each other off guard. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh. Jump? What the? Maybe try to bait in an option there. Oh! Ah, oh, no, it's here. Oh, you can you can flash kick that on reaction. When he does the Rekka and then he does the pullback thing, Guile is really good into that situation because you can always flash kick it. Oh, good, perfect parry. A little bit of damage, but back to neutral. Ooh, trying to read the the tech the, the tick uh, tech throw. Guile standing uh, forward heavy kick. Uh, throwing ball, right? Oh my god. Yeah, it's throwing ball. Put some airborne. Level 3 here? No. Uh, Doesn't does this... want to cash out level 3 there? Yeah, that was when, so much when damage. When is the time? When is the time, if not then? In burnout now, too. This is really uh, bad. If you're Guile, you level 2 here. And it gets really hard for loot. Oh, yeah, that's it, that's it. there you go. Damn. Good set, though. Tight Good set. set. Tight yeah. set. Almost a reverse 30. That was really close. Almost. Well, I gotta go pick up my food. Yeah. Yep. Honestly, great showing from Mozo. Maybe it was just like the nerves of being on stream. Um, and then like they went away once he thought he lost the set. And then once it was like, oh my god, wait, I can do this? You know, maybe they came back, you know? I don't know. I don't know how many tournaments he's been to. It, it never goes away completely. Um, but you can learn to handle it better. He threw his own shimmy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think maybe he messed up the combo uh, when he in the last round when he could have uh, level three. He certainly had it ready. He, he had the level three ready. Maybe he didn't want to cash out. I don't really know. 
Oh, Jadana. I, I guess she showed up while I was on commentary. She's wearing glasses, okay. Didn't know she wore glasses. Or maybe I did? I don't really know. It surprised me right now. How about let's say that? I can't be wrong, right? <laughs> Where is Diego? My man is running late. <clears throat> Alright, we got Jadana and Dumas. Dumas. Dumas dropping the CT off his tag. Akuma, huh? Dumas, a Marissa player. He also plays Jamie. Um, but I guess he's trying out the Akuma this week. Maybe just for maybe just till he loses, or maybe uh, maybe for the whole bracket. Who knows? We got a couple people here who have been playing Akuma exclusively. People like an Akuma. I'm sure, people are. He's very good. He's got air fireball. That's cool. He's got crazy good uh, frame data. I think someone posted a hurt box on his fireball, and it was like really, really like not as extended as like other characters like Ken or Ryu and Kyle. Right? <coughs> He's got great buttons. He's got crazy messed up setups. And so Ooh. You're gonna execute just me? I don't think so. I don't think so. No, no, no. Dumas gonna carry that into the next round and carry that knowledge. I can't execution test her. She's got meter. Ah oh, man. See, that's the, that's like the uh, JP command grab where it's like as soon as people start seeing the Q, as soon as people have enough experience with the Q, it's gonna stop working. But maybe not. Maybe if the mental stack is no. That's what fighting games are, right? You're, you're, you're looking for the mental stack. Things that are reactable, if you're looking for them, stop being reactable. Um, if you're not looking for them, or if there's too much going on, stuff like that. So Jatana up 1-0 here. Nice. Doing the sweep there, that will set up for a... I don't know if it sets up for a save jump, I thought that it set up for a... Uh, a grab if you dashed forward. But, not too familiar with Akuma yet. <clears throat> Ooh! Kinda good with that whiff. Are you kidding me? No, he has fireball. Yeah. What are you gonna do about that? What are you gonna do about that? At that point, you accept that you're getting, you're, you're losing the round probably. You may as well jump. Well, not really. If you if you neutral jump and you successfully get over the fireball, it depends on the spacing. Um, if if uh, Akuma's gonna be able to like drive rush forward and do some really special move that's gonna chip you anyway, um, or if he's gonna be able to hit you out of the air. Not familiar enough yet. Wanna... Oh, gotta play. Later!
Let's get this mission started. Let me have some fun. Round one. Fight. Ten left. Yeah. Score. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Breaking room. 
Activate. What's going on? It's your boy, that boy. I wanna, I wanna see this round up close and personal of the Akuma and Luke matchup. What's going on? Oh, I was already for a second. I miss being already. Actually, it's very fun being already for a little bit. There are so many Akuma players now. There are so many. I'm surprised more Ken players haven't picked up Akuma. Bash picked up Akuma. What's going on, T3? That boy already? True, actually. Okay, T3. I saw the rest of the photo. I thought you were making shit up about the dolphin, the baby. And I I saw the image because all I saw was the gorilla. And I got excited about the gorilla. So I understand the baby and the dolphin. I know what you're talking about now. I'm, I, I'm within it. And I agree. I see, I see the image. I fuck with the image, bro. I need to seek the Psycho Power baby. But we have Junior Juness on the Luke Classic with Vash repping Akuma now. Just as we stated before, Ken Blaze dropping just to play Akuma. This man's fireballs are insane. You can just throw out a fireball and DP immediately. Or you can just grab, you know? Still miss that demon flip grab, but they moved it on the teleport, which I get it. The classic gap closer just to bring the character closer. Nice grab into the corner. That's a really good option, just to jump backwards like that, the call out with the, uh, I believe that's Heavy Kick. Oh my god, already put in the corner. This man melts like butter. Boom! Already a first round taken right there. Although I have yet to see anyone use the teleport and or grab yet at a hog. Uh, I don't know how safe that, that, that... Not so much safe, or just like what utility you can get out of it. Maybe a really good cross-up when you're in the corner? Because you can hit people out of it, it's kind of insane. Reacts with the enhanced DP. Oh, sorry, the over... the OD DP. Oh, we got Kiko, alright. Alright, go ahead, Kiko. Tell us about Street Fighter. Okay. Man's on the mic making noises about Street Fighter. He gets it. Okay. okay. Yes, Kiko, that was a level 2 confirmed. Very good. <laughs> I had a Muppet join me. That was insane. Big fan of Beaker. Huh? <laughs> he can't, that, that, dude, that, that, Kiko can't, can't get away from it, man. I missed it, and I already saw the other way around where Kuma just goes. Oh, with a nice level 3 confirm, he's not going to let it get DI'd. And that's going to put him in a burnout, I believe. Yep, absolutely a great place for Junior Juness with that burnout. Just one interaction. Yep, just do that all game. Excellent DP. Psycho Baby for Street Fighter 7, true. Do you think the Psycho Power stunts the growth, though? Do you think that has side effects? Right? Like, maybe in the next game, OD meter is going to be stunted for him. Or maybe we have enhanced. Maybe he's all like... Oh, couldn't get it off in time. I don't know what you could do with a baby in a Street Fighter. Maybe make it like Bedman from, like, Guilty Gear? Who knows? God, I love Akuma, man. This character is so awesome. Definitely missed the Street Fighter V version of Akuma a bit more, but the character's really fucking cool what he's allowed to do in this game with the dry brush. Ooh, that's gonna be a huge footage. Oh no, he dropped it! But the fact is, he put... Oh, and he picks it up anyway. It does not matter. Junior Junior's on the scene. Ooh, bam! Beep, 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 beep. We got the real mix. Psycho power definitely stuns through. True. That baby is actually 60. It's a 10,000 year old demon. And it's actually M. Bison. M. Bison's back. He's the baby. Confirmed. 
It's crazy, man. We got a lot of OG players out here, man. We got DJ Rally Rel. We got Kite back. It's good to see. Mix it up with a new blood like Jadana and then uh, Artie for sure. I miss Kais. We don't. We lost our Lily player. Moment of silence for Kais, please. Back. Thank you. Thank you. I, that, that does nothing. Ego is trying to show me that the right joystick of my Xbox controller is going to do a new play. It does not. Satsu and no baby. Shut up. <laughs> I'm getting styled on over here, by the way. I'm commentating the match and commentating what's being happened off screen right now. It's insane, too, that, like, if you were to do a Raging Demon, you can actually delay the input to where the Drive Rush will come out. So you can bait people with the Drive Rush and finish the uh, Raging Demon. It's kind of nuts. It's really cool, though. I don't know how practical it is, but you can definitely get some, like, baits out of it. But they'll definitely see the Light Punches coming. Ops in to use that critical art, which is going to do a lot more damage on Akuma because of his paper fin. And I'm going to punch. Ooh! Oh my god, man. That man has a hole for him. Uh-huh. Punish? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. uh, fantastic punish and patience from Junior Juniors. Really adapting really nicely against this character. I actually don't know if, for example, what Ed is supposed to do in the Akuma matchup. It just seems like you're going to have an awful time. Which sucks, because I enjoy seeing Junior Juniors play uh, Ed, but uh, I don't think you want to play Ed in the Akuma. I could be wrong about that, though. This doesn't look fun. He's going to punish that OD DP right there. Nice! So smart to get rid of the Drive Rush. Peter, ooh, <laughs> this is going to hurt really bad. Oh, just barely. Nice low. For the demon flip. Oh, I thought that would kill. Fireballs all day, baby. Oh! Oh! <laughs> A simple jump. I don't know who put the theme song in the mix for the tournament. But God bless you. I need the El Forte fame just to give people some anxiety. This is going to be a level 3 confirm right here. This is going to hurt. Oh, he dropped it! It's okay. It does not matter. Oh, man, he's definitely, like, revving it up. Okay. Okay. Oh, an interaction. Oh! Oh! He stepped back! He's so smart! It is indeed a banger chatter. Oh, man. That's some. I'm gonna hide that. We don't need to see that. Public just need to know where I work. I'm lounging on this couch, man. I'm just waiting for my games to be called. But this fantastic job by Junior Junes win. Way to handle that Akuma player. Yo, JJ. Let me ask you something. How are you? Com uh, how comfortable are you with the Ed Akuma matchup? How comfortable are you with the Ed Akuma matchup? Yeah. Is it? Does that feel bad for you? Yeah? yeah? What what can Ed not do that Akuma does better? Okay. I'd like to see it too. First, where's your ass at? I got teased too because T3 showed up twice. And I'm like, ah, oh, finally. We don't see him anymore. That's okay. Ed's doing strong. We see the Gundam style over here. No one fucks with Kiko's lit epic style. Hello, Floki. How are you, my friend? That's another person that's not here right now, and it makes me very upset. Floki, you playing Akuma? Where's the Honda? Uh, it's in retirement at the moment. It is in retirement, and it's it feels bad because Akuma seems hell no. 
Dude, it's crazy too, because I retired the moment where Kuma got the. Uh, sorry, uh, Honda got the most gas with his setups. Like, praying uh, Sumo Spirit being ended from his bread and butter, like, punish combo is insane. 12 frames you have to do anything you want within that hard knockdown with Sumo Spirit. It's nuts. You can do anything you want to. And that medium punch or a low punch gets you close enough just to do uh, a command grab if you want to. I'll pick up Honda for Niku. That's my goat. Hey, yo. Finally. I got a co-host. Waiting for that. Junior Junes versus Kite. Be an interesting matchup. Kite, kind of the goat. Not gonna lie in terms of raw skill, but JJ is the... He's a people champ, you know? Look at that smile, bro. Exactly. That smile is full enough to fill everyone's spirits with joy. And then he picks Luke and you go, Luke. Damn, I want the Ed so bad, bro. I, do, so I understand why you don't want to do it. This it's for the culture, he's like he says. This matchup for Ed is not. Yeah, why don't you make your known, your known, yourself known to the chat who I'm talking with right so now? There we go. They don't know who I am. I'm, I'm that guy. Uh, Kuma versus Luke. Now, I know JJ likes this matchup. He, he, Luke two touches this character, so... Man, he loves playing Akuma. It's not yeah. like he just did, didn't do it. Ah, oh, the training stage. Classic. So nice pair. There we go. One, no, no drops? And now we got corner pressure. What's going for? Oh, Jimmy? So, what do you think about, what do you think about this matchup? Because I know Akuma's got plus frames for no reason. I'm going to be real. This matchup is really bad for Akuma. <laughs> it's awful. <laughs> because, like, the amount of damage that Luke can just shit out randomly off of any confirm, it's just like, you just have fun. You know? Kai, Kai is a player very good at keeping aggressive and putting pressure on the opponent. Right. Jury player. So, yeah. already. I don't think it's necessarily that bad for Akuma, because obviously we just saw Akuma just get the upper hand, but mm -hmm. I truly believe if we're playing 50 matches, Luke's going to come out on top. Mm -hmm. okay. So much okay. more that I think Luke can do in terms of like confirming rather than what Akuma can do. Okay, word, word. I'm not going to lie, I've been off the streets for like a week playing multiverses, so... Brother, I haven't played in three months, so you're all good on that. <laughs> <laughs> just observing. <laughs> I do like that move that JJ likes to do, where uh, the Luke players will do that little shoulder chest, and it gives them a little bit of a 50-50 on the grab or a punch, and that's going to be an excellent, excellent punish on that. Alright, our final round here now. I'm, I'm watching these players, right? And it does seem like JJ might have a bit of an uphill battle. Yeah. But I don't think that's going to be skill. Uh, These fireballs are, are they, I know you said you can just jump them, that shit's hard. It is, They're scary it is. as hell. The thing is, I, I say you can jump them, but the thing is, oh. you gotta know he's gonna throw out the fireball. Bit of a, a bit of an interesting guy there. I guess go, just going for a raw hope and a of There's a certain level where the worst option is the best option. Yeah, that's probably death right there, actually. Yeah, that's a good idea that. Level 3, cash out, yeah. Mm. They could have gone better. They could have done a better level three than that. I know he has the Raging Demon, which is his actual. No. Three, Do you know where that's from? No. That's a Street Fighter Cross Tekken Super right there, bro. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh yeah, that shit gas. I, I'm personally not a fan. I get it. I understand why. Kite, do the taunt. <laughs> Kite, literally give up 60 seconds of your life to get a shit in Akuma. JJ, do the taunt. Let's get shit in Akuma. Right, right. Ooh, good parry. Great perfect parry that fireball. Those wake up charge fireballs kind of scary, but I feel like it's an option that's like an uh, uh, early game option that's going to be people. Once you run the math, it's like it's going to pass. Right. Because you can't cancel it, can you? I don't know. Yeah, no, so I don't know personally. I just know that like if you're burned out <coughs> and, and you're oh, uh, you're losing, uh, have fun dancing around the fireballs. Yeah, no, that's bad. That's not even bad. That's but actually... Kite burns himself out for damage, drops the combo, but JJ takes the... Uh, Wake up, unfortunately. I can't, I can't, I would love to reach out. I gotta see what chat's saying. <laughs> Dude, I don't know who Nacho Nate is, but he's throwing mad disrespect right now. <laughs> I'm coming to you, Nacho Nate. Is that, that Nar? That's my brother. Oh, okay. Oh, he, your brother knows who I am. He <laughs> really knows who I am. Yeah, he absolutely does know who you are. <laughs> Okay, throw it on our subby buttons. Oh, oh, what, oh my that's god, he's capitalized! <laughs> that's, that's, that's what I'm saying. Like, and it doesn't matter when you throw out this level 3 on Luke, because it's a Kuma, as I was saying earlier, it does so much does fucking so much damage, damage, man. 
Oh, he's in burnout. Ooh, now you're now you guys have fun. Extra plus Never four, mind. But That's it matter. gonna kill. Is that dude? Is that kill? No. Wow. All right. You know, I'm not gonna lie, Kite should have waited like for like a couple more hits. Yeah, we see the Ragey Demon on screen, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. I was talking about So I was talking about this earlier, and now that you're here, I'm gonna repeat myself. But with Raging Demon, because of the inputs, you could delay it where you could do the drive rush and into Raging Demon. So like the light, light two okay, light punches yeah. and then you drive rush and then you finish it. Okay. So you could delay it. It's kinda cool. I don't know, I was saying, I don't know how practical it is, but it, I think it's saucy. That is saucy. That is saucy. That sounds sick. Alright. Okay, DI there. Now JJ burnt out here, which is not a good time to be, I guess. So. Ooh. Oh, but here in the air, does he get, what's he get? Out of that air, air toss too? Now you got your meter back. And there's the toes deck. Watch your toes. We're playing Tekken out here. Oh my god, Akuma's feet are diesel, bro. What the fuck? Look at his calves. Look at his ankles. His ankles? His ankles. Okay. So is that level, that's level one, right? Or level two? That's level two. Walk Warning. course. If it was a little bit closer, Kite could have capitalized on a walk rush. I don't, think, I don't think he meant to side switch there. Okay, yup. Uh, oh, hey, nice side Good hit. Good hit. Oh, nice. Nice refresh. Goes to level two. What's that burnout? Yeah, that makes sense. Cause he's about to get his. Oh no, he has no driver. I, I misread that meter. That's crazy. Now we're just gonna watch them throw fireballs. <laughs> now this is the real Street Fighter, yeah. actually. Street Fighter, a game about shooting your opponent. Okay. Oh, that fireball quick, bro. That's fast as hell. Bless you, box. Absolutely. Bless you, box. Praise up. Praise up on the juice box. It's up. Man, chat's gone. I can't read this message. Chat dies, bro. There's Rip no, chat. No chat. It's okay. Well, they don't. They don't say anything of substance. They just complain. That's fair. No modern. No yeah, modern chat didn't get any bumps. Mm. Why is Zangief good now? That's actually. A good <laughs> I have. Why Dude, is Zangief good now? I was talking to Groove last week, and he was telling me that he likes to do headbutts, and I was watching him headbutt on the stream. That chunks. Your, Bro, your drive rush I'm meter sorry. so goddamn much. No, I'm sorry. Groove came back? Groove is here. Groove is back. Is Groove here right now? Not no, he's right? not here no. right now. Oh, Groove is back. That's <laughs> crazy. I hate that character so much. I'm gonna be real with Floki. Yeah, it is kind of disrespectful that Ken did not get any buffs. I'll be honest. And why do I feel like Luke got buffed with his nerves? I feel like that's kind of crazy. Did he? I... It feels I like he's it. still just good. Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying. It's <laughs> like he's just like the freshest poster boy. Ken's still chilling. Yeah, I don't think yeah, Ken's no, bad by any means. No, no, no. I think that like as of right now, the game feels really good. It does, it you does. know. Does. I think we buff Ed Jab and we're good. Let's get make it a little bit bigger. I think it's Ed small. needs more range on his little. His, yeah, his standing. Like, yeah. Uh, oh, not his flicker. I mean, his standing. His light flicker is good, but his standing light punch is like really tiny. Akuma made me start playing again, even though I don't play Akuma. That's what's up. That's crazy, because I have played against Akuma, and it makes me not want to play. <laughs> See, that's you know what? It's really funny. I, I feel the same way about El Fuerte. I can't wait for El Fuerte to come back in this game. I will not touch that character. I'm just happy he's in the fucking game. Ed is Diet Ken. It's very true. That's true. That's valid. It's weird how, like, so... Ed is Ken, but harder. <laughs> <laughs> He just has to do more stuff. Ooh, Fuerte. This man hates Fuerte. You know why? Because this guy is a, um... What's his name? What's the old man from Street Fighter 4? Uh, Two stances. Uh, Gen? No, 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 no. The old man. I can't remember the old man's name. Gen, yeah, Gen. Oh, yeah, you oh, said Gen. Gen. I thought you said Dan. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I thought you said Dan. No, I was Gen. like, what? <laughs> gone. 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 This gone. man's a Gen player. That's why he plays... He hates El Fuerte. It's literally get. I'm sorry. I heard Dan. I heard Dan. Banned. Mods. Mods. Banned. The man. God. It's so obnoxious. I was talking about it over there. I'm waiting for the logo at Evo. They're gonna pop yeah. the Capcom yeah. logo. They yeah. spray it, and that shit's getting drenched in oil. <laughs> Shower. <laughs> That's all I'm waiting for, man. El <laughs> Forte, no. man. No, 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 no. I'm only an El Forte meme because I want him in the game. I, I watch El Forte from afar. Raced right? up, drive rush is full screen. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, 
I, I get another headbutt, but it's sliding on the floor, right? It's a low. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, God. Imagine Yuri into this game. Who? Yuri? Oh, uh, yeah. Imagine his brother. Who the fuck's his brother? The, what's his face? The, the icy hot guy. Oh, 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 uh, Gil. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even know much about Gil. No! no. What's wrong? What's what what's wrong with uh Yurian? Everyone loves Yurian. Shaq? No, oh, Yurian's so cool. I, I want like, Cody. I want Cody. I think Cody's Cody. coming back for I sure. I want Cody and I want Q. I never there's, played G. There's no way they did, don't put Cody in this game where he's not in his prison outfit again. He definitely got arrested again after oh, yeah, being course, there. Cool. He's definitely arrested again. That man's never breaking it out. No, I want you to deal with it. That's the, that's that, the yeah, I don't have to deal with it. I'm not going like to deal with it. You have to deal with it. In fact, there's probably going to be a little bit space underneath so I can headbutt underneath it. Mm, mm. And even if I can't headbutt under it, I can Dri slide under it. Drive rush knife. <laughs> Drive rush run up. Um, what's that? What negative edge? <laughs> I'm just a commentator. You deal with it. That's what you Listen. say. Listen. That's what you say. Then I see you pull up the brackets. You're gonna. <laughs> Listen. You say you're a commentator, but then the commentator bracket comes out. Then what happens? That's the issue. He loses the acoustics. <laughs> okay, we got Don. We got Diego, Diego and Jadonna. Oh, okay. Wait, I thought you said Don. I was like, Don's here? Yeah, Don. Don seems to win a tournament. He started that. They they can possibly put a guest character in this game, right? You I, think they would? I don't know if they would. I would be hyped. But I wonder who it would be. Tekken? Oh, probably. Dude, imagine putting a... Uh, dry brush electric? <laughs> sounds terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> if, you could dry, if you could electric dry brush cancel? Oh, no. no, no, no. Actually, you know what makes more sense if it was King? Because then you can... Because yeah. you know how he has the, like, the point of move and he runs yeah, and stuff yeah, like yeah. that? that could be imagine that with dry brush. Right? That's, That's like a perfect. diet El Fuerte right yeah. there, right? you know? If they're gonna do a guest character though, it probably would be Terry Bogard. Drive, I mean, rush, power, crush, I command, should. grab as king? That absolutely sounds fun. Also, give me if we're giving doing guest characters, I want Skullomania in the game. True, so true. Uh Skullomania or D Dark? Is yeah. that his name? Yeah. Uh wait. Is it D Dark? I have no idea who the fuck's talking about. It's the the guy that has the the pipe bomb with a mask. The blonde hair, so. and he has like eyes like this. Give me Faust. They're never putting Guilty Gear in this game. Y'all forgot Dudley? Drive Rush Faust? You're insane. Y'all forgot Dudley? Why do I want Dudley? Why would I want Dudley when we have Ed? That's my question. If there's any representative I want from Third Strike, it's going to be. Oh, this guy? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, D Dark. Wait, wait, wait. Is this his, that's his name, right? Yeah, D Dark. Um, Doctrine Dark. That actually looks, he looks kind of yeah. sick. He's, it's really cool. I love his Bob Pipe Bomb setup. I, I want Necro. I want Yurian. I want. The twins are not, definitely not coming back. Um, I'd rather take Q. I want Q. I want Q. And maybe Sean. If they can work Sean into an actual character. I want. If they give Sean an actual basketball move. Let him let him dunk. Right. Let him have Yo like, like oh man, but that would bro, be like DP is a layup and if you do EXE layups and then he dunks on you. Like come on. Oh no, if you lay up off the wall, he can catch the ball and dunk on Yo, you. Yo, he can no way. <laughs> be so sick. A Robo Honda would go insane actually. <laughs> Yes, of course. Q is so much more interesting than Dudley. Are you in, are you insane? Facts, facts. Honestly, though, I want Shadow Blue Gorilla. Give me a new character. Uh, we were just talking about that because I finally saw the image. Because all yeah. I saw was a gorilla in that image. I didn't okay. see the baby in the dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> we know M Bison's coming back. M Bison's the baby. They, oh, that makes sense. Oh, bro, imagine they put like toddler M Bison in the game. M he's like super small. <laughs> Actually, you know what? To be fair, they could make the baby into um, uh, the nanobots, for, uh, not the nanobots, the server bots from MV2, MVC2. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. The little like Lego looking things from oh, Mega Man. Oh, speaking of which, M. Bison is dead, but this stage teases his return. He's his hat's back. right there! His hat's in the back there and his body's in the back. You know what I hate too? Look at all the sets, man. He's gonna come back as Seth. Oh, you're right, I hate you're that. right. Okay, Jadana, great jury player. 
Good to see you trying to kite quit. Uh, and Diego! Uh, uh, we see a Ken. I was gonna say, there's no Ken in sight. Really. I saw him playing JP! That was crazy. He was playing JP! Nice, nice stuff there. Good stuff to drive rush. Good. That's, was that air kick? That, or, uh, air kick? Does she have an air kick? She has have an air kick, yes. Okay, work. Yeah, so I thought she was air kick. Just dive just kick. Throw. Dive a kick! Throw. Okay. Throw. Red. Throw. Oh, okay. Oh. What are you gonna do there? You're, you're literally like getting your you're Oh yeah, Abel. I forgot about Abel. I don't know every character. Abel Street Fighter 4. It's the main character for Street Fighter 4. Oh, okay. I yeah, yeah. Yeah, no one does because he didn't have any character, <laughs> anything oh, okay. redeeming qualities about him. Um, I did hear rumors that they were like some leak happened and we're getting female Abel. I, I don't know how much sense that makes, but whatever. Well, based on how this game works, we'll give him a bunch of personality to be a fan favorite. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> they put him in. Give me Dan. Dan's definitely coming back. There's no way he's not. Yeah, jab, jab, drive rush. Love that. Love that. Yeah, that's that boys in the stage, yeah. Ooh, okay, DB and the... Oh! Oh, gets the weak kick off of it. Okay. Not as much damage as you normally get. Oh, good. good she got a pop it for sure, but that guy is very smart. Yeah, just get, get the damage. David! Cash out. Oh, what a David. What a waste of time. Okay, no, no makeup option there. Goes for a Jimmy. Dago walks back with his control. Dragon left. Okay, just hits him. Catches him, not blocking. Yeah. I can see you playing Dan. I probably would. I, if, if Dan is good and still silly, I'd play Dan to piss people off. Yeah. I mean, Street Fighter V, he was like top tier. Top tier. You know what's crazy? Okay. That could be Seth. It could be Tyrant back there, too. Tyrant from Resident Evil. Yo. Right? That'd be a sick guest character. Instead of Urian. I'm guessing two okay. grabs. No? Wow, okay. Uh, this is the second time he didn't go for the grab. I wonder if uh, John's gonna recommend like, that one. I feel like he's going for grab into strength. throw, strike. Oh, gets the underneath. Great that, great that. Way to end it. Hakan will win. Tomorrow, probably. Dude, I'll kill for Hakan. Hakan. Interesting twist there. The, the parry nerf is so huge, dude. It's so good. Just tap parry being worth I still have to get used to the fact that you can't tap parry as well. It's not good. Anymore. It's a really good, like, call out option still, oh, right? Oh, yes, for sure. But, but it's, it's nice that it's not, like, a, a consistent, like, defensive option it as to be the block button. <laughs> <laughs> Why block when you can parry? Yeah. Okay. Oh. With DB not a great time, especially with Diego having it's a huge time to the DI there. Drop, 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 excuse me? No one ever expects a second no, DI. Oh, that was insane! Never. <laughs> Spend it? Yep. Okay, yep, cash out. It's gonna get her some meter back in the meantime. Oh, yeah. You're burnt out. I'm trying to use that. Get the damage. Damn, still, still has the three usages on those fireballs. Oh! Well, it sucks for right Jerry, that it's really hard for her to play the fireball work, so it's working out. Oh, my god. Clutch. That was, that was three dry DIs that I gave that right Yeah, yeah. That was nuts. There's a man. Oh, JP. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Shout out T3. I hate this character. <laughs> I'm taking. I'm gonna take a nap. Alright, so now up, to, up to Diego switches, brings it up to JP. Character that I feel like he's definitely a lot worse now. I'm starting to wonder, like, if that option where uh, JP teleports, that if you can still drive under uh, drive rush underneath, or JP players have figured something out for that. Oh, good call out on the Amnesia. Shall we? <laughs> <laughs> now 
now. Got a driver. Yeah. That means it. Yeah. That's what I was talking about. Is like when you drive rush that immediately when you see it, and they teleport, it gives you some opportunity to do things. Ed actually kind of cooks in this matchup. Really? Because uh, Spark is Spark is a fireball, so it beats Pierce. Ah, oh, that's smart. Stop the fireball! No, it was on wow. DP. I was about to say. That was kind of nuts. Speaking of Ed, do you know that he's just a Tekken character, right? Ed? It's just, uh, what's his face? Steve. Uh, Steve. Yeah, yeah. You just Steve from, uh, Street Fighter Street Cross Tekken. Tekken, yeah, yeah. Oh! Cool. Like that break there. Yeah, it's hard to And now we are once again watching the minigame. Oh my god, knows how to get out of it. Very smart. That's gonna be- Oh. We'll get enough for the level 1 there. But we have level 1 now, so you should be careful. He's gonna use that as a DP option. Disrespect for a misinput. Oh my god, he could come back. He could come back. Burn out against Jake. Oh! Great hit, great hit. I think I would have liked to see him throw just keep throwing projectiles. No help. Jonathan's burned out. Just throw everything at her. Go, go, go. Just keep the chip damage up. Put the pressure on. Oh god. You know, I've never, I've never really kind of like read that, but now that I just chatter right here, say Jada, I can never unsee it now. Jada. Jada. J a d a, instead of Jadana. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's my girl Jada. Oh whatever. Jada and Smith. That's <laughs> Jada. Oh, I don't know if it's friendly, bro. I'm playing Street Fighter. All right. I'm waiting to my Grand Blue match, so I got a whole time to talk. I got a whole lot of things to waffle about, chat. This is the first Street Fighter stream I've ever watched at Hog. I just play Melee. That's what's up. What are you playing Melee? I was there last week. Did I play you? It's hard for me to remember every Melee player. There's so many of you. Someone's dying in the background. The last Hog was two weeks ago? Okay, we definitely did that play. You moved out? I play Kirby. I come to Hog and I play Kirby. Straight into the Akuma matchup again. Goat. 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 The way I be bond. That's a sheep, actually. I think they're the same thing. There we go. We got Akuma versus Jury. Lost my co-commentator because they want to go practice Street Fighter. What a bum. Happy birthday, Illish. Person three, as always. Very clean match right there. Lion. Now, I am here to stay, I am here to stay that despite the allegations of Smash Bros. being smelly, Hog has some chaps that know how to clean up, so I, I will fight, I contest, and defend the melee players. It does not smell. Ooh, Will and Jeunesse. 
Grand Blue as we pop the level 3 into that. I peaked excitement and I look back and I see a like, fantastic level 3 under. Boom! We're out of here. Yeah, uh, I love that Jury's level 2 just makes her into a uh, MDC uh, character. It's very enjoyable to watch. Same with Blanca, actually. It's very cool. I love how they're handling installs in this game, where the installs just make them different characters from different games. Welcome back, Hikaho. Alright. Anything else? What do, you, what do you think about this matchup, Hiko? Okay. What about that kick? What do you think of that kick? Kick. <laughs> I'm gonna pass out. <laughs> I don't know why. I, I, I couldn't even expecting any type of noise, but the kick is gonna is what kills me, bro. It's not even that funny. Oh god, we're gonna see the round finish. Cole. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Um, so, we got a match down, it's game one. Uh, game two, excuse me. One match, one to the side, uh-huh. And, uh, what do you think the mix-up is here? Huh? Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Anyway, that uh, that Akuma move that you just did with the the OD like little like back, uh, quarter circle backwards is a really fucked up move, man. There's so many frames. Jade is gonna close out the match with this level three that I think could kill. Right? This kills, right? No, it doesn't. Oh my god. Okay. Oh god. Fucking sponsor. Yeah, pretty much. Oh. Wait a minute, we're turning that around. It's a fantastic level 3 there from Vash. Dude, I love watching Vash play. I remember when Akuma came out, it was him and Burst sitting there for hours on end, laughing the fuck out of his character. I love watching people be so dedicated and just laughing consistently. I'm something that I'm very envious of. It's a sight to behold. It's such a beautiful time when the fact that every character release lines up with Hog Tuesday at 11 o'clock at night, and you just see all the fellows that who play Street Fighter just wait till 11, and then every game system, every setup just turns into a Street Fighter setup. Oh, this guy moves in that, and that's gonna hit the round there for Bash. Uh oh, the goat walked in. Kyo reset. Ready to hold her title down as the top Rambo player here. Classic with David. And go now and fight there. The wall splat right there. Some good damage. Grab. I don't know if I just got called. Okay, I got a call. See you later, chat.
Akuma
get it. Life been trying me. I learned all my lessons. I realized I gotta kill with my blessings. I'm working hard every day to be a better man. If practice makes you think that I'm already a better man. Are you worthy of So success is my medicine. Destined for greatness, so you know that I'm ready. Come on. 
ready for the next battle. Round one.
for the next battle.
for the next battle.
I'm set up two. Can I have Jadonna and Ward? Jadonna and Ward. Set up two. Yes, sir. You stood on business. I can't lie. Huh? You stood on business. Hey, man. You stood on business.
for the next battle. Round one. Fight.
gorgeous.
the next battle. Round one. Fight.
battle. Round one.
round one.
battle.
ready for the next battle. Red dog skin. Round one. Fight. <laughs>
Grand Blue Fantasy Versus Rising. Marvelous! 
Believe in victory. Battle one. Engage. <laughs> 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 Great! <laughs> 
祭りだ
きついウィスキー Believe in victory Battle 1 Engage Believe in victory. Battle one. Engage. <laughs>
によって普段どんな C メイクってかすかおすすめはこのアジって魚なんですけどみりん干しにしたやつを一つ言っていいっすかいい
Believe in victory. Battle one. Engage. Oh, yeah. 